traditionally across mm. all culture, being heterosexual is considered the norm. But what if you feel that you're different? Perhaps you feel that you could be gay, lesbian, or bisexual. Realizing that you may be different is difficult. Do you yearn for a listening ear? Do you have questions that are left unanswered? Let's take this journey together. You may have heard of terms such as being in the closet or coming out. What do they mean? When we say someone is in the closet or closeted, it means that the person has not disclosed his or her sexual orientation, behavior, and gender identity to others. Coming out is when one begins to recognize oneself as a gay person and discloses his or her sexual orientation to others. There are different stages in coming out. The ideal endpoint is to integrate one's sexual orientation with one's life and accept oneself completely. A good start is accepting that one is different. Some people might go through this process linearly, while others may not go through all these stages at all and yet still be able to accept themselves as who they really are. In the process of coming out, be mindful that everyone has different life situations and environment. They need to consider how those around them might react, such as family and friends. Some can be very receptive, while others can have strong negative reactions. One should only plan on disclosing one's sexuality oh. when one is really ready and feels safe. Here are some things you should consider when you are certain of your sexuality. 1. Take your time. Be sure that you're ready when coming out and not because you feel pressured to do so. 2. Equip yourself with the correct information and knowledge. Understand and accept yourself. 3. Try starting with the most accepting person. There's no need to tell everyone. You can test the water by checking how receptive the person is. Share a piece of news or information related to LGBTQ issues and see how they react to it. 4. Find the right time and space. This allows you to talk without any interruption. 5. Be prepared for all possible responses. The person could turn out to be supportive and understanding. On the contrary, he or she might not respond well initially by rejecting you or dismissing what you have shared. Remember, most people are not familiar with such a situation and might find it hard to accept when someone they know discloses his or her sexuality. 6. Have contingency plans. For example, find a friend who can help you explain your situation. Always take note. Do not come out when feeling negative or if you're doing so to hurt someone, even yourself, intentionally. A positive coming out experience can help people gain more confidence about themselves and their sexuality. It also helps one to feel more assured that there's someone who will be supportive in this ongoing journey. If the first few coming out experiences are not as smooth, don't feel disheartened. Learn from these experiences and find another opportunity to disclose this to someone more supportive. These people who might not be supportive at your first attempt may proceed to find out more and find another chance to understand what you're going through. When the time is right, you can talk about this with them again. Remember, these concepts are most relevant when you have already ascertained your sexual orientation.